So my graphics card is broken. This happens when I put new uh, heatsink uh, coolant on my graphics card because it was overheating at like 200 degrees. So after I did that and I cleaned it up, this happened. So I must have done something but did it wrong. Windows doesn't boot normally. So I looked up the problem. And uh, the only way to fix it is to bake it in the oven. Show you a picture of what this person did. So you bake it at a 385 for about eight minutes. That's what I'm gonna do. So here's my graphics card with the uh, uh, case off of it. It's just the heat sink and the fan. And I gotta take all this apart, stick it straight in the oven. Now here it is naked. I just, I just threw it in real quick to see if it works without adding the heat sink or anything. So as long as there are no lines, I'll finish it. If not, I'm gonna stick it back in the oven. <gasps> no fucking lines? Are you serious? Holy shit, look at that. Start windows normally. This is taking longer than normal. 
But. But. Oh! I am so fucking happy. Thank Jeebus. Thank Jeebus. Alright, my card is now put back together completely. And by the way, this is what came out of the heatsink. All that garbage. The card used to run at uh, 90 Celsius idle. So that's what made me do all this. I'm gonna put it in and see how hot it runs now. All I, all I can say is wow. I, my card now runs at 49 Celsius and it's actually going down because I had to put the speed for the fan at 100% when it was at 60. And in addition to cleaning out my graphics card and uh, putting the new heatsink fluid on it and whatever, I did the same thing for my processor. My processor ran at 80 Celsius and now it's under 40, which is amazing. I've never seen it this low ever. <laughs> I guess that's what you get when you don't clean your computer for five years.